So, as we all see, it's like six o'clock in the morning, a little after six. And I'm at the gym. I'm waiting on Shanta. She's on her way. Um, oh, there she's pulling up right now. Um, the worst thing about the gym that I go to, which is this one right here. Um, and it's not even the fact that it's not like the best gym in the world. It's the, it's the simple fact that they let teenagers ages 14 and 19 show up to the gym, which is so gross. Um, and then like the college kids, cause I live in a college town. Those kids are at the gym and it's just like, ew, I hate you people. Like, stop looking at me. Like, I get it. I'm morbidly obese. Leave me alone. Um, but it's like, then I start feeling a little insecure and I hate that and I don't want that for myself. So it's like, I'm trying, I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> this girl staring at me like a crazy person. Anywho, we're about to, we're going in here. We're gonna, we're gonna get it together. And we're excited. We're gonna be excited. We're not gonna be crazy. Go, I got your food. Oh, <laughs> here, get your food. Remember I made that Tuscan chicken stuff Ooh, or whatever? Thank you. You're welcome. So, okay, we're going to go in here. We're going to get a little workout done. And then, because today's like a very easy day. So we're going to get that done. And then I will get back to you guys in a second. black folks in here <laughs> praise oh the lord God. got a ring light got the other two lights okay let me turn it off i'm loaded i feel that for you i hate it she made it because ah! <laughs> i wasn't finna come it was it was tired and feeling bad because you know girls be having issues sometimes with their body parts on the insides but you know that's okay because God is good. Yeah. Now we were on the phone yeah. just now, like when you were driving over here, and you were about to say some like really prolific, yeah. really fun yeah. stuff. So mm -hmm. yeah, no, that's for real. It's important because it's, okay. it's, it's, it's gonna make me a little. I had to I had to check myself a little bit, right? Hey, Amen. I'm trying to change my mindset for real. Mm -hmm. Like I'm tired of this. Yeah, I'm tired of like saying it mm -hmm. and not doing it, right? Mm. I'm going to ask you a favor as a friend. Mm -hmm. If I bring up something, and you know what I'm talking about, because I'm not going to say no names. Mm -hmm. If I bring up anything about past things mm -hmm. that I need to be done let go by now mm -hmm. so that I can move forward with my life, mm -hmm. I need you to divert that. Okay. So, and just like, you know what I'm saying? If you if you even feel like it's an inkling or something, I need you to stop it mm -hmm. and be like, bruh, let it go. We're going to let it go. Let it go. We don't need to talk about it anymore because it's time for me to move forward. Mm -hmm. And I, I feel like in order for me to not be bitter about any situations, mm -hmm. I need to stop talking about it. I'm talking about job related. Mm -hmm. Talking about relationships. Mm -hmm. Talking about friendships. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Talking about things that I need to let go. Because they don't Bad service situation. us anymore. And it's like holding me back. Yeah. Like bad. Yeah. And I think it's like the first step for me to kind of like, okay... You need to check your shit because it, it might be your attitude that, you know, that is, is keeping you in the same. Right. Because I'm traumatized. Mm hmm I'm traumatized. Yeah. And Having those emotions are real. I think it. processing through those emotions and then learning to let go, just like how we talked about the other day when we were spending time for your birthday Period. about, you know, <laughs> that I, was a really good time. That was a really club, good time. <laughs> but, um. Write your, write that letter, and and burn it. Period. And release that energy away from you, so that you could start fresh and start new. Yeah. Because you deserve every opportunity to be happy. And so do you. Man. You know. Ah! It's and, on to better things, and that's what we're doing. We're like that's what this is about. This this is so different from what I'm used to doing. I'm never 
told my story in such an authentic way. Yeah. Everything has been so controlled by other people. Anytime my story has ever been told, it's been told by someone else. It's never been told by me. Period. And that's why we're doing this. Because I want to lose that 45 pounds. I want to go to Puerto Rico with you. I want to be able to be happy in a healthy relationship Period. with with someone. But I can't do that if I don't do the things that are necessary, the work on the inside of me. So now I'm at a point in my life, and I know that you're at a point in your life where we're now working on ourselves. And that's what this whole journey about, is about, growing and learning and telling ourselves yes, saying it's okay for us to do and to have the things that we want. Because we work so damn hard just to go home and sit at home. Period. But we could be doing all Shit, the fun we things that we see everybody stuff. else doing. Oh, my God. So, and you know something else, too? Yeah. That I'm gonna check, we going to check each other about mm -hmm. our emotions. Mm -hmm. I, I just been watching a lot of stuff. And people, we be saying stuff. I be saying stuff. You be mm -hmm. saying stuff. We be saying this stuff. Just talking. About right? each ourselves. In general. But, like, when, when we say, like, oh, I'm upset or I'm mad. A lot of times I saw this TikTok and mm -hmm. she was just breaking it down because she was talking about, I need to go, I need to go see my therapist. You know what I'm saying? I need Amen. to go back to therapy. Amen. But for real, because it really gives you like things that you can use in real world situations. It's not about you just like telling all your business to somebody. It's mm -hmm. like to use these tools so that you can move forward in life and do the things that you want to do. But saying you, you're mad about something mm -hmm. or you're angry about something or this person pissed me off but that's not what you're really feeling and like Amen. to dissect what you're actually feeling yes and the girl ended up coming to the terms with that she felt humiliated like i need to Come get on. i need to get we got to get our definition game mm -hmm. up and like what we're really feeling and talking because manifestation people take it to like a a, a spiritual level mm -hmm. but in reality like if you put that put it into into our real lives and us applying it manifesting mm -hmm. is literally take fear out of the aspect and just do the things that you really want to do without worrying about people's judgment and stuff Come on. we could really do whatever we want do you understand like we are capable of doing absolutely everything and i am sick and tired of being in the brat race mm. because for what reason bro we all gonna die you know what i'm saying exactly. everybody gonna be off this planet exactly. in a minute why not enjoy it but like genuinely morally like just Seeing what it feels like to be in a positive mindset and mm -hmm. genuinely be that way. Like, for real. Like, us uplifting each other. I want, like, we have, you are that type of friend that I feel like, damn, you've been here for this whole time. And, y'all, when I say Nate has been here for this whole, like, since I've been here, and we done been through our ups and downs, but still have figured out how to, like, communicate with each other and, like, mm -hmm. talk to each other about stuff. Yeah. He's been, like, a really good friend. And I'm like recognizing that I have a good friend here. Like you I really do. do. A very genuine no, person. No, because you're a good friend to me. Because I haven't I, always been. You though. have I feel not. Like I've been. You going haven't. Through it. I had to get. But I swear, like every single I'm time. I'm for real. I I'm for real. That. I'm dead serious. But you know, I love you, and and it's because every time we go through something, you'll come back and you'll you'll see it. You'll be like, damn, okay, this is what happened, but this is why. You know, like sometimes you can't figure out your emotions in the moment but you always come back and you're like nate i was feeling this and this is the reason why we're complex people bro it's complex like you gotta people. get to understanding yourself it's right. all about open communication and because we have the open communication we've That's always nice. been able to stand the test of time we've known each other for almost five years yeah <laughs> That's insanity. this is this and i'm gonna say this i don't have a lot of like, and now I recognize what people say when, when they say like, it doesn't matter how many friends you have mm -hmm. per se. It's the quality of the the friendship, the relationship that you have between like, I'm, and I'm telling you, anytime I've met people through you, it's never been, I haven't felt, it's a new experience. So mm -hmm. and, and if I say uncomfortable, it's more of like a change. So mm -hmm. I'm putting myself in an uncomfortable situation, but in a good way, I was, I was challenging yourself, but not yeah. in a way that's like, uncomfortable you get what i'm saying yeah like not unsafe <laughs> not not messy you know what i'm saying not just extra as fuck nothing it was always to really just in, in, first introduce me to new people mm -hmm. to ex introduce me to a new experience to get me out there dude and i'm just like i'm a very appreciative of you nate i'm for real i love you so I'm much i'm serious this is uh, it's a big deal i'm so excited Gross. we're we're about to go in here we're gonna get our cute little workout on it's gonna be real quick 
Uh, and then we're gonna go home. I gotta get up in the morning because I gotta go get my hair done. And then I think we might be getting a tattoo or a piercing tomorrow. They're doing that little special. What? We're gonna talk about it off camera because yeah. I might not show it. <laughs> but <I'm funny. laughs> but we're going inside. We're going inside. We're going inside.